Welcome to another Fiddlehead Fiddle Lesson. I'm going to show you the tune Down in the Valley. And before we get started, just want to say you should know the low second finger position. So on the A, like say we have open, one, low two. You should be able to do that. If you don't already know that, I have a video that's uh, an introduction to that that you can watch first and then do this. Um, just come, get comfortable with it. Also, you should be able to know the D scale. G scale, the basic major scales. All right, so I'm going to play the tune and then teach it to you in separate parts. We're going to learn each quarter of the tune and then we'll play it at kind of a slow tempo and you can play it along with. All right, so here it goes. Whole tune down in the valley. Okay, let's get started. Up close for the left hand view. So I recommend starting by finding your notes on the D. Open, one, two, three. Okay, good. Once you have that, start by practicing open, three. It's kind of an odd interval and a big jump. So I would do that a few times. Get it in your ear and in your fingers. Okay, next we're going to add some notes. We're going to go up to open A. And now we're going to add first on A to three on D. Two, three, two, three. Those two notes are longer. They get three beats. Again, one, two, three. Two, three. Two, three. Just from a further view. Two, three. Two, three. All right, that's the first quarter of the tune. Second quarter, if you don't know the first, review it. Second quarter, starting first on A. I'm going to go down to 3 on D now. That's kind of hard. Do that a few times. Okay. And now we're going to add two long notes on the A. So, now I'm going to play the first and second quarters together. If you need to, rewind and watch those. Okay, here we go. That's the whole first half of the tune. Okay, good. Now I'm going to play the third quarter of Down in the Back. It has a similar arc as the first quarter, but it's different notes. Um, so it's going to start open to two. Open two on D. And then we're going to go to open A. So all short notes, single beats. Um, next we're going to add low two on A to open A. That's the hardest part of the tune because we have regular two on D and then low two on A. 
what a lot of beginning students typically do is that once they start learning like doing things with regular two and low two or high two and low two we could say the high two gets dragged flat and the low two gets dragged sharp so you really want to start to get this in your ear and um, just practice it a lot I'm gonna play this one uh, a whole bunch because I want you to really hear it spend time listening to it and then practice it a bunch rewind and do this next exercise a lot so we're gonna cycle on the third quarter here we go very difficult if you're a beginner to get right and to get it in tune so I would not move on too quick from that stay with that a little bit next part's relatively easy the fourth court quarter start low two on A and go that's ending on D3 here it is again I'm now going to do the whole second half of the tune. One, two, three. uncertain yet in the both those halves practice them as usual you know before trying the whole thing there's no hurry to do the whole thing all right now um, assuming you have practiced that I'm gonna play the whole thing at a moderate tempo and you can try to play along all right here we go I'll count you in one two three one two three That's the whole tune down in the valley. Great song if you're learning the low second finger. Okay, assuming you've practiced that, learned that, can play it from memory, you can then start the tune on the G string. I'm going to do that and then we'll try starting it on the A string as well. So every tune you learn, you can get, you can learn more from it. Every tune becomes a, a guide for you to learn some new thing is the way to think about fiddling and learning music in general. So, uh, let's see, it's starting on the G string. I'll count, count in. Feel free to play along. One, two, three. Start it on the A string. One, two. That's it. Well, thanks for watching. Hope it was helpful. Let me know if you liked it, if that could be improved somehow. Just stay in touch. Please subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye.
excellent.